it seriously, it just nullifies so many main phases where someone should have pressure on the other person. It's so stupid. Hate it. But anyways, we're up against it, so we gotta counter it. Hey, what's up, Cooter? My friend, are you talking about Zazu? My yellow side green cheek on here. Seconds until minions spawn. Follow my blade. This will be a sword. I sent Larks to for an invade. I like my guide, it thinks uh Elgna nine. Yeah, I think this account is Diamond One, if I remember correctly. I haven't played on it for a couple weeks. <clears throat> I mean it looks like I'm up against the biggest move, so it should be an easy game, right? Okay, I think they started both sides. W start, I'm more tonic, inspiration, corrupting potion. With grasp, bone fighting. You couldn't get a, like a more defensive start. This guy doesn't want to play. It goes bald side, doesn't have his blue. I don't need to put my board down. It's because we saw Shake already. Oh, he messed up his CS. We're gonna let this push back into us a little bit. So we're just gonna last hit. Because of the wave position, it should push back toward us. Oh, he has minion dematerializer? He probably still has time work tonic, right? Or is that in the same category? Got some decent trades in them. Got two of his potions. Damn, I just crit his ass. Holy. Oh, big crit. Get going, coming. All right, back up. Even without the crit, I would have killed him with the flash auto ignite. But, uh. It just made it insta death. Alright. Um, is he shoving? No. We'll wait for team up. Getting team on against G4 is really important. You guys up online for always. What's up, Critter? Can you talk about your bird? What do you want to hear? How she bites at us and yells at us all the time. 
or how sweet she is when she finally settles down. Once I, once, you guys want to see the one-shot build? I mean, I could showcase it. Mm. Is he maxing W2? Is that what that was? Is that slow lasted for a while? Or like it was a big slow? I think we've had it since July, so three or four months, something like that. Second one back. got about a 10 CS lead and we got that first kill on him. We're in a pretty good spot so far. <coughs> As you wish. I'm about to be ganked? How can they gank me? J4 does zero damage. I could just spin away from Shaco. Back to buy the stabbies. Let's see if I can punish men. Hmm. Let's see if I can take some of those camps. J4 is not pushing it very fast. I'd probably take Shaco's whole top drum roll. Yeah. I missed what? Two minions of VXB so far? And I got two full camps? That's pretty worth it. You don't always have to beat your opponent just by killing them in lane over and over again. You can beat them by like taking advantage of uh, them being really passive in lane to make proactive moves. I'm gonna ping oh, I thought J4 was about to do something, but no, he just keeps doing nothing. Shove them in and look to maybe take their blue. I got the blue. It's so worth. I mean, J4 is just not doing anything, man. 
So we need to look to make a bunch of proactive moves. Add my jungler topside so I can work with her. To deny the Shaco even more. So I've taken three camps from Shaco so far. Which is setting him behind the Tulia. <coughs> I think I just take it back here. I'll get Zerker Greaves plus Zeal. I can take my uh, jungler's Krugs on my lane. Your jungler typically doesn't even want to take Krugs. They take it from them, so they don't even have to worry about it. I think I'm going to go cover this way first since he's hard shoving. So it's important to also keep track on like what your lane's doing. Rampage. Alright. Well, instead of taking Krugs, I guess I'm going for his, uh, his turret. Since he TP'd, I just get first blood turret for free. And he even do anything. This guy has no clue. Oh no, I didn't see Shaco. But... Damn. That's about to kill that Lulu too. Oh well. One for one and got Shaco's Grom. Or... Damn, they're missing all their skill shots. No good. Like waves bouncing back to me. Lulu's been out of lane for so long that uh, Kaisa's being uh, bullied a lot. I am your worst <coughs> nightmare. Thirty CS advantage, got a level advantage, got two kills. She goes bottom, so I'm gonna go take out this pink ward. Oh, wait, they move it? Alright, G4 is moving down, so we'll go and try to take top tier 2. So J4 probably thought we were rotating into Mountain Dragon, which is why he went over there. see what from his top side I can take. I'll put the ward here because that's where Shaco would go, like, Q from to go for his wolves. I think it's too greedy to go for the blue here, just because J4 got back to lane and I'm sitting on a lot of gold.
There's a pink in the blue buff bush? I thought I checked it. I didn't see it. it maybe, it, maybe it's one of those pinks that doesn't show up immediately for whatever reason. I could have sworn I checked it, but... Maybe I got mind game by Riot. Victor's here, Lulu's here. I got some good vision. For whatever reason, the are rotating to mid, so I'll just take pop turret. These guys have no sense of macro. My team's got pressure on mid turret, too. So we get at least one turret for free. I misclicked a couple times there. Feels fun. <coughs> hey, my uh, brick turtle did a lot of work though. It got a turret, uh, two thirds of the next turret. Team's making good play in mid. Pickaxe would go towards Rage Blade. Yeah, sub XC for Apathy. Mm, I'm actually not sure where they are. I'm gonna wait for my team to pressure for our move up. I am your worst nightmare. Let's see if I can't get a good warren. As you wish. And any Uh, are they not defending? What's going on? I'm pretty sure I can just ignore this J4. I'm just gonna go towards the fire dragon, I think.
Have you got bottom? I had a feeling that Kaisa was going to do that, so I was already positioned my mouse cursor like away from where I thought Kaisa would jump to. Her ult is very fast, but it isn't instant, so you can you can react to it and get away from her. That word is about to die anyways. I'll go put another word. <coughs> Why you build life still so late? I have Taste of Blood and Remus Hunter. Remus Hunter gives a lot of uh, health back. Shaco's top side. I mean, this J4 is pretty relevant. Alright, I think I should just be able to end the game. Probably have to push this wave actually. Oh, no way. I actually can't end the game now. That's actually so lame. <laughs> Whatever. We just gotta take the red buff. Follow my blade. In matchups where you would want to take Sun Impact, instead you take Sorcery with Transcendence, Nimbus Cloak, uh, Jabberwocky. I am your worst nightmare. Just testing the waters. Okay, I think my team's ending. 